Hey guys, Nick the Tech Kid here, and by request, uh, recently, a YouTuber contacted me through my channel, saying he wants me to do a tutorial on how to add special effects to your Microsoft PowerPoint presentations, so I'm just going to show him how to do it, and this applies to everyone here, everyone who's watching, just in case you don't know how to do it, so yeah. Alright, so, first thing, you want to open up Microsoft PowerPoint, so I'm just going to search, oops. PowerPoint. Okay, then it can be 2003 or 2007. They're about the same thing. Maybe 2007 has a, another look, but I'm just using 2003 for an example. Just wait for it to load up and. Okay. So you'll come. You'll come here and it'll ask you to click to add title or click to add subtitle. And so. Okay. It's similar to like Microsoft Word. Uh, just choose like a word art. I'm gonna insert a word art. I'm gonna do just a random design. Say t test, and then okay. And say I wanna say I wanna add like special effects to that. So what I do is just right click the image that I said, so click custom animation. Then a bunch of stuff is gonna come up. Okay, so. And then over here, just click Add Effect. And if you want an entrance, just hover your mouse over Entrance and choose where you want. So a diamond, and that's what it'll look like, a test. Or um, you can, if you want to remove it, just click Remove, and it'll just remove that effect. Uh, there are some other ones there if you would like. Uh, I don't know where more effects takes you, but yeah. Emphasis is... Like, if you want to grow or shrink your text or just spin it around, but it's kind of weird. But exit, I've, I actually prefer exit and entrance, exit, and motion paths the most because they're, like, like they're mostly used in PowerPoint presentations. But I don't know what emphasis is. Why would anybody use emphasis? Okay, so exit, you could choose the same ones, like, in here. And motion paths, you could... Like, draw your own custom path, up, right, left, down, I don't know. Whatever you want. Alright, and after you're done with that, like, that's all you really need to know. There's same stuff like this. Insert diagram or insert clip art, insert thing, fill color, line color, font color, shadow style. Um, Alright, so I'm just going to add some random stuff. So I'm just going to add yeah, an entrance effects. All right. Then, well, what I'm gonna do after I'm done, like my whole slideshow. This is just a test. It's not my full thing. I'm just gonna click play, and it's gonna play my thing. And if you want to add more slides, just right click this white area here and click new slide, and click to add your title and click to add your text. But um, what you want is you don't actually want those boxes there because they kind of annoy you and you may not see what you're writing. So you go under content layouts and, set, and select a blank layout and there you go. You have more space and yeah, the small boxes don't get in your way. And that's all there is to PowerPoint. Just making slideshows, uh, adding pictures, adding backgrounds. You can, you can fill in your thing. So here what I'm going to do is... Select it. Huh. You could draw some things. Auto shapes. You can use some auto shapes. And that's all there is to it. Also, if you want to add another slide, like I showed you that way. Or you could just click new slide at the top here. Design. You could choose how your slide, your design is slide. Like, you can have an ocean background. Uh, globe. Or whatever you want, whatever is comfortable with you. And at the bottom here, you can see click to add notes. That's good for you too. An outline is how it looks like. It's just like the full thing, but I prefer the... There you go. And just end show, and you're all good. That's how you create your PowerPoint presentations. That's how you add special effects. That's pretty much what the, the idea of it. Alright, and after your whole thing is done, you could click, um, view show, and what I'm going to do is, there you go, test, and it's all good. Alright, so, 
thanks for watching. I hope the YouTuber that asked me this hopefully got an idea of what you have to do and like the special effects. It's very simple and if you follow my tutorial I think you'll get the hang of it and please rate, comment, subscribe, add me as a friend. Personal message me for any requests or contact me through my channel. Um, my new blog, uh, techkidblog.tk. Tech and yeah, thanks for watching guys and I hope you have a great day.